Okay, so now it's time to clean the buttons, the knobs. Yeah, these ornaments, they have some, uh, you see, finger marks, grease, dust, fat. Also, on this groove, you see, here, on this groove, it's also grease, fat, a lot of dust, you see here. So how I'm dealing with this? You see all of them they have, see? I'm dealing very simple. See, these are the tones, correctors, yeah? So all the knobs are out. Everything is made by aluminum and some plastic. See this one, it's a bunch of aluminum. Nice. Real quality, yeah? Huh? On that times they made real, real, real things, let's say. And this is the amplifier, yeah? Sony integrated stereo amplifier TAF7. Yeah, nice. The fat amplifier. Okay. So how I'm doing with this? I'm, I have a plastic box. Yeah? I'm putting some this dish washing liquid. Yeah, see? Good. After that, I have water. Until it's covering the buttons, yeah? Okay, the knobs. Okay. Now I'm mixing a little bit. See? It's yellowish. Until he is making some foam on top, some bubbles. Bubbles, bubbles. Okay. And what's next? Next is simple. Time for jumping in the water. Okay. One by one. And usually I'm leaving a couple of hours to soak everything. To be to became mild, yeah. so this is how it's going with this. And with the face plate, it will be similar. The face plate is here, but on the face face plate, I have also some uh, some things to fix. Yeah, so this is the amplifier. Front cover, yeah. Also, it's full of, with aluminium, like you see here. It's a lot of old dust. But what I mentioned on this one, if you are if you are looking on the left side, this one, yeah, here, it's uh, the glue. It's slack complete, yeah. So I have to, I have to take some epoxy and to glue this one, this one back here to make, uh, to make steady, solid like a rock, yeah. Okay, so with this one, I will do the same. I have a, a bigger plastic uh, tray. Yeah, I'm using this tray. It's bigger than previous one, but it's uh, bigger enough. It's big enough for the f front plate. Yeah, you see, it's enough. Yeah, and the process it's 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 same. Yeah, this one out, some dish washing liquid. Yeah, water. Stir a little bit. Yeah. And same, I will leave a couple of couple of hours. Okay, this is good. I'll continue. Yeah. This uh, liquid 
for uh, dish washing is not uh, is not deteriorating the the markings yeah because some chemicals they can deteriorate this rotting these markings yeah and uh, this uh, this one which I'm using is not uh, it's not destroying this yeah it's not eating this paint yeah and now I have a small rug and I'm helping a little bit to clean these marks finger marks yeah step by step gentle yeah and it will be like like new yeah this dust which is down here Perfect. Okay, so later on you will see how it looks. And now it's time for cleaning. Yeah, easy, easy. All the buttons, all the knobs with brush. Yeah. This is how I'm cleaning and should be fine. If it's not fine, you have to soak them more. Yeah. You see? Shiny, shiny. I'm doing like that with all of them, yeah, one by one, yeah, rinse a little bit, I'll put in another box, so all, all of them, one by one like that, because you have the control of cleaning, yeah. And you can see all the sides, yeah. All the edges. See how beautiful it is. And after all of them, they are brushed. Again, rinse with clean water under the shower and uh, I will dry them with a lint free rag and after that they will be ready for installation back on front front panel of this unit And now this rectangular knobs. This is the power knob. And also this one. Clean now. Another rectangular move. And 
and uh, if you like this please subscribe to this channel to see more videos if you have questions you can leave on the comments below below the description box if you want to share this video with others you can share for sure it's something to learn also i'm learning from other channels and i have to say thank you to you because you are watching and of course if you have other ideas if you have suggestions if you have inputs if you want to see other things belongs to this kind of restoration so audio equipment yeah or other stuffs tell me and i will try all my best to revert with the answers yeah or other videos because i'm trying to to stick my channel to this kind of repairs restorations reviews step-by-step -step process tools i want to start also to 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 show to you the tools which I'm using here on the bench tools and uh, to talk about the about the soldering station the, the soldering station the tools which I'm using the processes the steps probes which I'm using multimeters which I'm using testers which I'm using for parts yeah. from where I'm buying the, the parts how, how, how I'm buying this I'm trying to, to cover all the all these processes I know for some of you are not uh, are not interesting let's say but for other people for sure they are uh, they, they will watch and they will put in practice this huh? if it's boring or something you can you can look to other videos because for sure all of you can find something interesting on my channel yeah? this is the process how i'm doing how i'm dealing with this and it's is no any other shortcut okay for this uh, for this kind of cleaning it's a good idea to have a yes ultrasonic ultrasonic but uh, i prefer to do like that okay so i rinse them with water yeah and now i'm continuing the cleaning process and also the inspection i will make also this visual inspection to see if are cleaned see it looks perfect here yeah so i'll do like that with all of them i will let for a couple of hours to to be dry yeah again inspection for all of them clean inside this groove to be to be clean yeah. dry and in a couple of hours now it's summer they will be they will be ready for use these rectangular ones also groove cleaned yeah cleaning 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 good this is the mute mute button okay Good also the volume knob perfect see power button also this one is okay switches Okay. The 
en fait. Ok. Also, this one passed the inspection. Super. A few more, and all of them they will be done. <coughs> Okay, so this one and one rectangular one more. Okay, perfect, and all of them they are arranged there. And now we'll continue with the front panel. Okay, so now. We will clean the front plate. Yeah. So, with the soft track. Cleaning, 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 cleaning. Yeah. Don't push too hard. Now, the brush. Yeah. All these edges around the knobs. Clean, 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 clean. This glass here, the bottom part, top part, inside a little bit, yeah. here inside only to remove the dust, because there's some dust, like you mentioned in the beginning, yeah, okay, this part you see, the which is moving, what we discuss, and now this one is ready, we will rinse with water, yeah. Under the shower, everything here. After the shower, like you know, it's necessary the drying, cleaning with a lint free rack. Also, visual inspection, and where I see some traces of dust or fat, this fat which is going between these rims, I removing it. I'm pressing a little bit harder with this rag and they are cleaning the rag is cleaning that that part you see so this rag is already wet I'll take another one okay this one is dry it looks perfect even inside here of this I mean this here it looks it looks very well yeah super Okay, cleaning, drying. Okay, also on this side, you see here is this part, which it will be necessary to, to glue. I will, I, will, I will use some epoxy glue for this, because it's, it's doing a really good job. And it will be fixed like from factory. But for this, it will be necessary to be well dry until tomorrow. It will stay under the sun to be dry. It looks perfect. Here a little bit on the screen, and that's all. Super. Now it's it's perfect done.